We'll guide you through how to create your own mod pack in Minecraft. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Mod packs are super useful and cool because you can go and put your favorite mods together and then easily go and play with them. And you can go and create multiple different mod packs depending upon what you want to go and play with. So let's go and get started. First of all, you need to come and quit off Minecraft. To go and do this, we're going to be using a really great app. But it's super important to note for this to go and work, you need to have Minecraft already installed on your computer. Now what you need to do is go and open up a web browser. So we'll go and do that now. And the app we're going to be using is called Curse Forge. So C-U-R-S-E-F-O-R-G-E. -E, all one word like so and come to curseforge.com. Before we get any further, a big shout out to the sponsor of this video, Apex Hosting. If you're looking to go and play Minecraft multiplayer with your friends, including modded Minecraft, then this is a great way to go and do it. There'll be a link down below which you can go and check out. At the moment, you can get 25% off your first invoice. Scroll down and you can start to take a look at some of their awesome benefits. For example, one-click install mod packs, DDoS protection so they're fully secure. So as I said, if you're looking to go and create a server, definitely go and check them out. Now to continue with the guide, what we need to do is head to the top right of curseforge.com and click on get curseforge app. And you can then just go and click on download standalone like so. The curseforge installer will go and download. Now what you need to do is go and locate it. So open up your file explorer, select downloads on the left and you can then go and run the installer. Go and double click it like so and it will open up. You can go and choose your language, click on next. You can see the installation folder. Make sure you accept the terms of use and privacy policy and you do need to be 18 years old or older. Make sure you accept this here and then click on accept and install and it'll go and start. All you need to do is wait. There you should go and see the option for Minecraft. If you can't, go and click on the plus where it says add a game and you can scan your computer for games or manually go and add it. So what you can do is go and click on browse and you can browse through mod packs, but of course we're going to be creating our own. So you can go and select mods instead. Just go and click on my mod packs at the top, then click on create and we can start creating our own pack. If there's a certain mod you want, make sure you go and know the version of it as that's really key. In this case, I'll just go and choose 1.20.1 as it's been out for a while, so the mod should be available for it. And you can then choose the mod loader. I'll just use Forge and then go and click on Create. You should then be taken into it and you can come over to the right here and you can click on Add More Content. Now we can go and start seeing the mods so we can go and add to it. In this case, I want to have the Just Enough Items mod and you get the idea. After you've gone and added the mods you want, you can then go and click on Minecraft in the top left. In this case here, so I can go and click on it. You can then see the mods you went and added here and when you're ready you can go and click on play in the top right. You can then go and click on play. You do need to confirm that you're playing a modded version of Minecraft which I do. And so here we are. You can then click on the mods to go and check them out and we can now go and get into a world and start playing with the pack. As you can see it's pretty cool and you can already go and see one of the mods I added which was the minimap mod in the top left. 